Toilet leaks are sneaky. Many toilet leaks are silent and can occur without you knowing. So it's a good idea to check for a leaking toilet at least twice a year. Start by removing the tank lid. Don't worry, even if you haven't cleaned the toilet for a while, the water in the tank will be clean. Put several drops of food coloring into the tank. Make sure you don't flush the toilet just yet. After about 10 minutes, look in the bowl. If you see food coloring in the bowl, you have a leak. Most toilet leaks are caused by a worn out flapper, a rubber stopper which seals water in the toilet tank. If this seal is not tight, leaks can occur. There are many different flappers on the market today, so bring the old flapper to your retailer to make sure you purchase the right flapper for your toilet. Before you start, turn off the water to the toilet. Next, flush the toilet to empty the tank. To remove the flapper, disconnect the chain from the flush arm. Unclip the flapper from the overfill valve. Set your new flapper in place and clip the chain onto the flush arm. Now turn the water back on and flush your toilet. Your repair is complete. If your toilet was installed before 1994, it might be better to replace it with a more efficient model than to repair it. Look for toilets carrying the water sense label. These toilets use around 30% less water than older toilets and are proven to perform. You might also be eligible for a rebate on a new water sense labeled toilet. Visit www.savingwater.org or call 206-684-7283 to learn more.